Gaming Dad here, back for another item shop review. It is Friday, June 21st, just past 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in Canada, and we have an item shop refresh. Want to give a shout out to all my subscribers. Thanks so much for your support, and without further ado, let's get in the review. So we've got the Marvel outfits returning to the item shop this evening. Starting off, we've got Moon Knight. I think this is a really cool looking outfit, actually. You got this cape off option. I think he looks really original, and I love, love this look. This is, like, perfect for in-game. Then we've got the Lego style, which looks great, and the Moon Knight's Cloak Back Bling. 1,500 V-Bucks. We've also got the Crescent Darts Pickaxe at 500. Next up is Blade. So this is the Blade bundle. Blade's got two different styles there, the default as well as the jacket style. Jacket looks great. You've also got the Sword of the Daywalker back bling, as well as the pickaxe. And of course, if you equip both, you can unsheath the pickaxe from the back bling. Then we've got the Day Flyer glider. Very cool look to this glider. And the Daywalker's Kata emote. 2300 V-Bucks for that bundle. Otherwise, you can get blade with the outfit and back bling. Uh, pickaxe and back bling. And then we've got the Shang-Chi bundle up next. So here's Shang-Chi. Just the one style. We've got the Lego style that looks pretty decent. The Great Protector's Shield Back Bling. The Blades of the Brother Hand Pickaxe. And the Dragon's Scale Wrap. 1800 V V-Bucks for that bundle. Otherwise you get the outfit with the Back Bling. The Pickaxe or Wrap on their own. Next up is the Hawkeye bundle. So here's Clint Barton. Also known as Hawkeye. Then we've got the Lego style. We've also got Hawk Guy's Arsenal. That's a cool looking back bling. Here's the Kate Bishop outfit. Lego style looks really good. Then we've got the Kate's Quiver back bling. And the Pick Ross Bow pickaxe. And the Tot Slicer pickaxe. As well as the Aerial Archer Glider. Finally, the Hawk Eyes loading screen. 2400 V-Bucks for that bundle, otherwise you get the outfits with their back blings, the pickaxes or the glider on their own. So above this in the item shop, by the way, we still have the John Cena, Bianca, and Becky. We've got the Metallica stuff up top. And then down on below, we've got Nick A30. We've got those Icon Series emotes from the other evening. Midsummer Midas, great outfit, pick it up while you can. Lots of summer stuff has been added to the item shop and should be here for some time. Surprise, the Star Playmakers bundle is here. So here are some updates. Love the Storm Racer outfit. Great looking outfit. Multiple styles, green, purple, and yellow. Great deal here at 1200 V-Bucks in my opinion. Pit Stop, probably my favorite of the two. Same deal with the styles. They all look great. And again, of course, the Lego style looks good. 1200 V-Bucks as well. Here's Hitman back again. Pretty hilarious. Here's the Lego style. And then we have the Hit Me Back Bling, which is reactive and it animates as you get eliminations. 1500. Up next, we have Bachi. Two different styles here the default as well as that spy option, which I think is the nicer of the two. There's the Lego style and the Mochi Back Bling. 1200 V Bucks. Up next, Criterion. The Lego style looks really good. I think the colors are awesome for this outfit, and there's the stabilizer back bling. It is a bit pricey at 2,000 V-Bucks though. Next up, we've got the Pumpernickel emote, 500 V-Bucks. And the Raise the Roof emote is here, 200 V-Bucks. Next up, High Rise Assault Trooper, nice and cheap at 800 V-Bucks. The Lego style looks pretty decent. Then we have Jonesy the first, another Jonesy variant. Lego style looks really good. Next up, Squat Kick, 800 V-Bucks. A little more pricey on the emote side. Here's the Relic Raves Swords pickaxe. It's reactive to weak points and it's 800 V-Bucks. Here's Maximilian, just the one outfit style. Lego style looks pretty decent. And then we have the Para Provisions back bling for 1200 V-Bucks. We've also got Jamila here. 
outfit is reactive to eliminations. You've got the Aflame style as well as this Jamila style. The Lego style is pretty spot on. And finally, we have the Scavengers kit back bling. 1,500 V-Bucks. We've got the new Neon Glow Bundle up next. So here's Nightlight. Definitely an eye-catching outfit here. The Lego style, honestly, is like spot on. Very good job there. Here's Light Show. Lego style is not quite as spot on, but it's, it's all right. We got the glow stick pickaxe. And finally, we have the glow rider glider. So it's 1800 V bucks for that bundle. Otherwise, you get the outfits or the pickaxe or glider on their own. We've also got Hemlock in the item shop, as well as the Arcane Arts bundle still. The same cars are here from Adidas, that Lambo. Jam tracks, nothing brand new. And then the usual packs down here at the bottom, including that Marvel royalty pack that came out the other day. Way too expensive at $37, though. Now, in terms of my favorite additions to the item shop this evening, in the Marvel category, definitely would be the Moon Knight outfit. And, it, and I think that Blade is also okay. They're probably my two favorites this evening up there. Down here in the other updates, I would probably go with the Pit Stop outfit as my next favorite. Comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item is. Let me know if you're picking up anything for the shop tonight. Please drop a like in the video. And if you're watching and you haven't done so, please do put that subscribe button and show me that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. Have a great evening. Until the next video, this is GamerDad out.